everybody, Jason here of GhostbustersNews.com, and as always, Ghostbusters News right here on YouTube. And last week, the Academy of Motion Pictures, Arts, and Sciences announced the shortlist for the 94th Oscars, with Ghostbusters Afterlife being included within the Best Visual Effects category. Now, in celebration of the announcement, Ghostbusters Afterlife special makeup and creature designer Arian Tootin shared a retro VHS-themed collection package, highlighting just some of the visual effects from the film giving us a much closer look at Gozer the Gozerian, the Terror Dogs, and one of our first clear shots of the age CGI model of Egon Spengler, which of course featured the likeness of the late Harold Ramis. Now the image provided here, the one that's on your screen right now, provides one of our best looks yet at Egon Spengler, showcasing visible aging, a slightly disheveled look, and much like Ramis in his later years, a bit of facial hair. And given that Egon Spengler appears with such a dominant off-colored appearance in the film, along with being semi-translucent, it is really nice to see the amount of care that was taken in bringing back not only this iconic film character, but also paying tribute to Ramis. Now when it comes to the Oscars, Afterlife has some pretty stiff competition, going up against such films as Spider-Man No Way Home, Dune, The Matrix Resurrection, and No Time to Die. Now once again, Ghostbusters Afterlife is part of the shortlist. It still needs to be voted on and nominated as part of the final five films that will make up the Oscar consideration. This whole procedure begins in late January, and of course, if Ghostbusters is nominated, we'll be sure to keep everyone updated here on Ghostbusters News. That's all I've got for here right now. As always, be sure to subscribe to Ghostbusters News here on YouTube. Bust that bell notification icon to stay up to date with everything that's happening within the Ghostbusters world. If you'd like to join up with Ghostbusters News, check out our Patreon page. We have a link to that down below in this video's description. And I'll see everybody right back here next time.